Remote configuration is the ability to control, configure, and monitor your devices remotely. So for remote configuration, you need a device that's controlling as well as the device that needs to be controlled. And both these devices have to be connected to the internet. But more than that, you got to take it one step further. You need to have like this common protocol or this unifying language that both these devices can talk. So when you're controlling devices, it needs to be real time, it needs to be secure, and it has both the devices, the device that's being controlled as well as the controller has to talk the same language besides being connected to the internet. When you think about remote configuration, you want to be able to control any kind of device from anywhere in the world. So say you have a Raspberry Pi connecting uh, a garage door or an Arduino that's controlling a coffee maker. All of these devices be have different platforms, but one unifying platform or protocol that will bring them together so that they're able to talk to each other is PubNub. Without a global data stream network, each device would be controlling a few set of devices. But say you have PubNub. So you have PubNub, it supports 75 different SDKs, different platforms. So all devices that can talk PubNub can basically talk to each other. The best part about remote configuration is that you can remotely configure or control your device. So you could uh, be anywhere in the world and still have devices collecting or sending information from anywhere else in the world, as long as both are connected to the internet and both are talking the same language. With more and more devices being connected to the internet, more and more data being gathered from these devices, it's extremely critical to have remote configuration to be able to monitor the state and to collect the data in real time from these devices.